Earlier this year, mysterious craters began to appear in Siberia, sparking countless theories as to their origins. Now scientists think they were caused by the explosion of gas underground. And the explanation could explain the loss of ships and aircraft in the controversial area known as the Bermuda Triangle. Three giant holes were spotted in the Yamal and Timur peninsulas provoking claims that they were a man-made hoax, meteorites, or even stray missiles. But now, after probing the largest of the craters, scientists said that they were most likely created by underground gas explosions. Heating from above the surface due to unusually warm climatic conditions, and from below, due to geological fault lines, led to a huge release of gas hydrates, reported the Siberian Times citing scientists from the Trofimic Institute of Petroleum Gas Geology and Geophysics in Novosibirsk. Gas hydrates are ice-like forms of water containing gas molecules, notably methane. They exist in permafrost regions such as northern Siberia, but also under the oceans in some parts of the world. The main element, and this is our working theory to explain the Yamal crater, was a release of gas hydrates, said scientist Vladimir Potapov. It turned out that there are gas hydrates both in the deep layer which on peninsula is several hundred meters down, and on the layer close to the surface. There might be another factor, or factors, that could have provoked the air clap. Each of the factors added up and gas exploded, leading to appearance of the crater. He stressed that the crater is located on the intersection of two tectonic faults. Yamal Peninsula is seismically quiet yet the area of the crater looked into had quite an active tectonic life. That means that the temperature there was higher than usual, Mr. Potapov said. Crucially, recent warm summer weather has melted gases trapped in layers just below the surface. The explanation for the formation of this crater might also explain the disappearance of boats and planes in the area referred to as the Bermuda Triangle, according to the experts. The area stretches from the British Overseas Territory in the North Atlantic Ocean to the Florida coast, to Puerto Rico. Russian scientist Igor Yeltsov, the deputy head of the Trofimic Institute, said, there is a version that the Bermuda Triangle is a consequence of gas hydrates reactions. They start to actively decompose with methane ice turning into gas. It happens in an avalanche-like way, like a nuclear reaction, producing huge amounts of gas. That makes the ocean heat up and ships sink in its waters mixed with a huge proportion of gas. The same leads to the air getting supersaturated with methane, which makes the atmosphere extremely turbulent and leads to aircraft crashes. Reporting the claims, the journal Science in Siberia dubbed the craters a distant relative of the Bermuda Triangle. Scientists conducted detailed research at the crater, including taking samples to a depth of 300 meters. We checked magnetic and radiation backgrounds, and found no abnormalities there, said Oleg Kushnerenko, chief engineer of a mission which lasted four days. Mr. Potapov said that their theory will be studied further. We all have to keep suggesting hypotheses and testing them, he said. The crater itself is incredibly interesting from a scientific point of view. He added there was a need to identify other areas in the world where such underground gas explosions can occur. We must also pay attention to areas where the same thing might potentially happen, he said. Mr. Kushnerenko also revealed that security concerns meant the research team were not allowed to go inside the crater which is around 70 meters deep. There was a great temptation to go down the crater, but the institute didn't give the go-ahead, saying it was too risky, he said. The crater they studied is in the Yom alone and it's autonomous, some 30 kilometers from the Bovainenkovo gas field. Mm -hmm.